Real estate numbers are now out for the month of August, and while home sales in Vancouver are starting to show signs of cooling after the introduction of a tax for foreign buyers, things couldn't be more different in the capital region, where more records have fallen and prices for detached homes are soaring. He fast reports. It's been a sign of the times around the capital region for a while, and it's not changing now. As September rolls in, real estate numbers for August are out, and for a sixth straight month, the region broke monthly sales records with 883 homes and condos sold, well over the 741 that sold in August 2015. It's almost to the point now where we're not comparing uh, this year to last. It's like we're comparing this year to best. Realtor Tony Joe says the numbers come as no surprise, but they also come at the same time Vancouver's market is showing signs of slowing down. The Greater Vancouver Real Estate Board releases its final August numbers Friday, but preliminary MLS data through the first two weeks of the month after the province's new 15% tax for foreign buyers went into effect there August 2nd showed a sharp drop, down 86% compared to the same time period last year. In Victoria, realtors say it's still too early to tell if having the tax in place on the mainland is driving sales across the strait. The number of uh, foreign investors in the region here has never been particularly large. You know, most of the movement that we've seen have been people from, uh, from Vancouver. But let's not forget, Victoria still remains um, uh, an area where most of the sales that occur here occur within Victoria. So people moving from one place to the next. Meanwhile, with the rise in sales, prices, especially for single-family homes in the capital, are reaching new heights. The real estate board says the benchmark price for a detached house in the region has gone up nearly 25% in the past 12 months, rising from a little over 600000 to nearly three-quarters of a million dollars. Industry watchers say the key will be seeing whether the trend lines continue into September, but as it stands, the capital region is on pace to beat 2015's total sales numbers within the next couple of weeks. East.